Hello everyone! Welcome to Kindergarten. Uh, this is a game where you play as a kindergartner, but everything is not what it seems. So I'm not good with intro, so let's just get right into it. Fun day. It looks like you haven't played before. Would you like to go through the tutorial? Sure. Uh, welcome to kindergarten. The school day is separated into five separate time intervals. The schoolyard, morning time, lunch, recess, and show and tell. Most characters want something done during the day. Try and pick one character to help each day. Completing a character's task all the way will unlock that character's special item. Special items can be reused infinitely. Every day is exactly the same as the one before. It is always Monday. Only special items are saved from day to day. Characters will respond differently to you depending on what items you have and what decisions you have made throughout the day. Okay. Um, the amount of money you're ca currently carrying. Okay, $2.50. It's not much, but for, for a kindergartner, it probably seems like that. Um, items in your inventory will appear here. Okay. What is that? A piece of gum in a pill? And apples represent how many actions you can take in a room. Alrighty then. Uh, this is some example dialogue for the tutorial. Okay, this response requires an item in order to be selected. Okay, so the pill. Uh, this response requires a dollar to be selected. And this response will use an apple if selected. Okay. Uh, possible responses to what the character is saying. Okay. Um... So wasp, uh, space, or left click. I, I thought I could use a controller, but apparently not. Um, eat apple is probably the enter key, and the planner is E. Okay. Um, tips. Once you are out of apples, the bell will ring and you will move to the next area. If you are outside of the area you started in, the bell will ring when you have one apple left. If you can't find a way to use all of your apples, use return or B to consume the rest of them and continue to the next area. Okay. Okay, so I haven't unlocked anything. So, is this anything? No? Can't look at that. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Yes. No. Nope. Screw off, kid. I'm busy. Oh, okay. Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Or they would if I had any. Nugget knows. Nugget knows no love or friendship since Billy went missing. Uh, what happened to Billy? Billy is missing. Poor Nugget misses Billy. But Nuggets cannot help him now. It is too late. Uh, do you know where he is? Nugget does not know. Nugget knows who knows. Who knows? Your questions upset poor Nugget. You push too hard. Nugget needs his pills. Nope. Much better. What are we talking about? Uh, Billy. Who? I don't know what you're talking about. Um... We were just talking about him. We were not. The principal has forbidden me from speaking about it, and if you press me any further, I will report you to him. Let's do it. I need to know. No, you don't. Enjoy your trip to the principal's office. Whatever. The principal just called me. He wants to see you in his office. What did you and this little weirdo do? Um, that's a good question. Well, get going then. The principal is an impatient man. Fine. So, I've been told that you're feeling sad about Billy. Um, who told you that? Oh, you know, we're just, uh, getting around, you know? It doesn't matter how I know, it's that I do know. I'm not sad about Billy. You're not? Then why are you so interested in his disappearance? Uh, were you listening to my conversation with Nugget? What? No, you shouldn't accuse authority figures of eavesdropping. I know what I know, because I'm the principal. Got it? Okay, sorry. It's become becoming increasingly clear to me that Billy's disappearance has greatly affected you. I want you to take these. They've helped the Nugget immensely. Uh, spelled immensely wrong. I think, anyways. You're giving me pills? 
Don't think of them as drugs. Think of them as uh, portable therapy to help you cope with your feelings. Um, okay, thanks. Take one, right now. No. Oh. Take it or there will be consequences. No. Oh. Then you leave me no choice. I can't risk you getting too close to this. What does that mean? Oh. Jesus. Uh, maybe take a pill next time. I didn't expect that. Okay, let's let's take the pill this time. Um Yes, I have. That's all this is about, right? Billy's missing and it's making you sad. You're not trying to find him or anything. You're just sad he's gone. Right? Phew. Okay, that makes this a whole lot easier. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna give you something and I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. What was it? Just a little something I ordered for this exact reason. Here, take one whenever you miss Billy too much, okay? Just don't tell anyone you got them from me. The hall monitor is waiting to take you back to class. Please head outside, okay? This rug seems a little out of place. There's some papers and a Monstermon card in here. Alrighty then. Did I not talk with you at all? No? Okay. Welcome back. I hope everything turned out okay with the principal. Everything is fine. Say, the principal didn't happen to give you anything, did he? Um, he gave me some pills. Oh, lucky day. You wouldn't mind if your lovely teacher had one now, would you? Be my guest. Good boy. Oh, that's nice. Thank you for that. Go on and enjoy the rest of your morning time. I know I will. Me too. Hey, don't go snooping around in. You know what? I don't really care. Do what you want. Okay. Um. This is Cindy's cubby. There's a monster mount card in here. Take it. Um. Okay, let's talk with people. Why the hell do you think I would want to be your morning buddy? Good point. Um. Oh, I don't really do the whole morning buddy thing anymore. My brother Billy was normally my buddy, but he's missing. Okay. Dude, you know you're not cool enough to talk to me, let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty is gonna hook me up with a sweet yo-yo. Whatever, jerk. Probably gonna be Nugget's friend if I can. What? You want to be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for that nonsense, so unless you're buying or selling something, get lost. What do you have for sale? Um, a yo-yo, screwdriver, or cigarettes. Um... Okay. Nugget does not wish to spend time- spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. What are you busy with? You are curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting. Perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Perhaps. Nugget is in need of a magnifying glass. Do this for Nugget before the next bell rings and you will be rewarded. Okay, there's a magnifying glass here. Uh, this is Lily's cubby. There's a magnifying glass in here. She's probably using it to look for clues about her missing brother. Take it. I have a magnifying glass for you. Have you found the item Nugget seeks? Yep. Excellent. Nugget is pleased. You may have this Mastermind card. Nugget is quite fond of it. Thanks. Now be gone. Nugget has important things to attend to. Sure. Sorry, sweetie, but I'm spending my morning time with my boyfriend. Whatever. Okay, is there anything? This is Nugget's cubby. There's appear to be a Nugget of some sort in here. Okay. Not gonna take that just yet. Um, go enjoy morning time before my high wears off. You're such a role model. Okay, so maybe I get the yo yo then? Heh, yo yo's. Don't know what it, what it is about these things, but Jerome loves them. You can have it for a dollar. What do you say? I just completely gave up on his voice. As you're doing business with you. Dude, you know you're not cool enough. Yup. 
You mean this yo-yo? Oh, come on. He told me he was going to save that for me. You can have it if you'll be my buddy. You got a deal. And since we're going to be friends, I think you should do something to help me out. You know, as a friend. Or, you know that creepy old janitor? He stole my laser pointer this morning. Said it was too bright and shiny for his old eyes. I need your help to get it back. When you're ready, I'll give you a hall pass. You can use it to get by the hall monitor. Once you're past him, head to the janitor's closet. My laser should be in there. Um, I can do that. Awesome. It should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Got it. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll give you the pass. I won't be able to dis I won't be able to distract the teacher for long, so head straight for the door. Don't talk to anyone on your way out. Not so fast there, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. There you go. A principal pass? Whoa, yeah, go do whatever, man. Sweet. I don't think I'm gonna make it. You can go do whatever as long as you have that pass. I don't really care. Um, excuse me, what? Oh, maybe, maybe I can't do it because of my apples. Well, did you get it? What? Okay, kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. We'll talk at lunch. Yeah, I didn't have time. Hey, kid, over here. Well, did you get it? I couldn't get it. Aw, oh, man, that's a shame. Looks like I'm just gonna have to deal with whatever punishment I get from this. You can keep the pass. I'll see you around. Cool, thanks. Alrighty then. You have anything else to say? You can keep that pass. I've been on, I've been on thin ice lately, so wish me luck when I have to face this punishment. Okay. No way a wormit like you is gonna be sitting with me. I didn't want to sit with you anyway. It's a garbage can. I'm not gonna dig through it to find stuff. Okay, why was I able to interact with it then? Sorry, sweetie. This spot is reserved for my boyfriend. Go sit with Ugly Lily over there. Ugly Lily? Heh, <laughs> yeah. Ugly Lily. Hey, why don't you go do me a little favor? If I give you this piece of gum, would you put it in her hair? I'll make it worth your while. Bonus points if you can do it and come back to me before lunch is over. Sure. Awesome, come see me when it's done. Okay. No one ever sits with poor Nugget. Nugget does not have any friends. I figured you'd be seeing me around now. Slop is no good, and I don't think anyone is brave enough to try a biscuit from the janitor. Dumb old man can, can't even spell it right. What do you have for sale? Uh, salad, a McGlob silly meal, and then that. Okay, I don't need any of that. Okay, so I have a hall pass. Let's go out. Hey, stop! You can't leave until lunch is over. Okay. What are you doing there, Sonny? Want some tasty, nutritious slop for lunch? Can I go to the bathroom? Oh, I'm not allowed to let any of you kitties out in the hall during lunch, but maybe you could do with me so a little something if you wanted to look the other way. Like what? Well, I seem to have misplaced my glasses. These old eyes can't read the menu without them. See if you can find a pair lying around and I'll let you out. Got anything else I can do? Well, that mopey little girl has been paying me to let her out. I don't see why you can't get the same deal. Um... I'll just try and find the glasses. Biscuit balls! Get your biscuit balls here! Get them while they're hot! Uh, you spelled biscuit wrong. What? No, I didn't. How would you even know? You can't even read. Monty can. Uh, is that the dweeb with the glasses? Who am I kidding? Of course it is. Hey, nerd. Um, what do you want? Got some janitor stuff you want to sell me? No, but I got a coffin for you to buy. Oh, Jesus. Let this be a lesson to you about correcting people's spelling. There. Lessons were learned. Lines were drawn. 
You're a good kid for letting me know that little monster is going around cranking spelling. And in a school of all places. Shameful the way kids turn out these days. Is he dead? What? No. I just hit him till we got all twitchy. He'll be fine in a year or two. Uh, that's a long time. You just let the old janitor know if anyone else has some anything to say about his spelling. I don't think that will happen again. Oh, these glasses flew off the nerd's face when I hit him. You can have them. These old eyes don't miss a thing. Right, thanks. Find your glasses for you. I found some glasses. Oh, lovely. Thanks so much. Go ahead and do what you gotta do. I won't stop you. Okay, so Lily went out. Go away, kid. I'll get in trouble if the principal hears you. Are you freaking kidding me right now? You followed me out to put gum in my hair? Uh, it appears that way. Just leave me alone. I have more important things to worry about than jerks like you. Yeah, I did- I did the thing. Eh, what? What did you say to him? Oh, I didn't see what that said. You should just rest now. I did your thing for you. Did you do it? Yep. But well, color me impressed. You would make a splendid boyfriend. Take this Monstermon card. And don't be shy about talking me- Talking to me tomorrow before school starts. Okay, sure. Um... Anyway, now that that's been taken care of, wanna buy one of my biscuit balls? No thanks. Um... How are you doing there, Sonny? Want some tasty slop? What's in it? It's an old family recipe. Lots of herbs and spices and salt and about 89% the principal secret ingredient. Uh, 89% is a lot. Oh, it's not that much. Supposedly, it keeps the slop in regulation with the government's new health standards. Uh, what's the secret ingredient? I can't tell you that. It's a secret. Also, I have no idea what it is either. You're feeding us a seasoned mystery in ingredient? But the seasoning is so good, it's the best part. Fine, I'll take some. There you go, buddy boy. Enjoy, and don't be shy about coming back for seconds. Plenty of slop to go around. Okay, where do I eat the, the slop? If, do I even eat it? Oh, there we go. There's a Monstermon card under this table. Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. Okay, kiddos, that's the recess bell. Go burn off all the delicious slop you just ate. Okay. Um. Don't bother me, kid. I'm trying to figure this out. Figure what out? It's this riddle about these stupid duck things. Apparently, if you shake them in the right order, something is supposed to happen. What's the riddle? Go twice the duck that's furthest south. Then two blue before red. After, return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong and you're dead. Okay, let me write this down. Give me one second. Um, okay. Twice the duck that's furthest south. So, yellow. Twice. Then two blue before red. So then blue times two, then red times one, unless it means like, don't do red. Um, then return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong and you're dead. So then yellow, then blue? I don't like autocorrect. Okay, that's ominous. Yeah, good luck solving that. I don't want to get involved now that I think about it. Hmm. Solve the duck riddle. Okay. So, yellow. Yellow. Blue. Blue. Red. Yellow. Blue. Ah, there we go. Simple enough. Okay, is there anything... Anything here? Go play while you are still young and thin. Sure. I know he did it. I don't know why, but I know he did. 
This is a statue of the principal. There's a red glint in his eyes. Creepy. <laughs> Just look at her. She looks so miserable. Good work. Alrighty then. Get out of here. I'm busy. You don't look busy. I am bi- Oh, what's the point? It's no fun being a bully when no matter how many kids you beat up, my dad still isn't coming back. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's horrible. A uh, little bit sentimental there. I miss everything about him, even the way he used to drink excessively. I miss everything about my dad. Okay. Danny waddled away. Waddle, waddle. Behold, the Nugget Cave. It is very deep and very dark. What secrets does it hold? Do you want to find out? Hmm. Sure. Oh, okay. You died. Jumping into holes you can't see the bottom of is generally considered a bad idea. Oh man, I have to do the thing again. Boo. Okay. Yellow. Blue. Blue, red, yellow, blue. There we go. Okay. I don't think there's anything else I can really do. So I think I just have to progress. That's the bell. Let's all head back inside for show and tell. Okay then. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Um, what is this? Can't tell. Whoa there, a whole bottle. You must have really been up in the principal's business today, huh? Feel free to leave those in your cubby. You know, for safekeeping. So who's next? Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Alrighty then. Day complete. I got five Monstermon cards. I think those are the things that surround the middle thing. Monday, again. Yup. This is the Freezy Guy Jim card. He's probably the coolest guy named Jim you'll ever meet. Hey. My name is technically Jim. This is the King Tower Beetle card. He's just a regular beetle that lives in the King's Tower. Okay. This is the Doom Jelly card. Goes perfectly with Doom Peanut Butter. Oh, I get it. That's nice. This is the Wall of Castle card. Too often walls get overshadowed by the castles they protect. Well, not this time. Yeah, justice for walls. This is the Cyclops Duckling card. It's not a species or anything, it's just a duckling that had its left eye pecked out by a bigger duckling. Aww, poor duckling. This is the Ogobop Go Golem card. No one knows what Ogobop really is, but everyone is too afraid to ask him. Oh, okay. Um, what's this? Did I bring some extra money to school? No. Because if I remember correctly, that's going to lead to a whole bunch of trouble. So I'll hold on to it for now. Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Um, I'll be your friend. What is your offering? Um, I only have friendship. Huh. <laughs> Perhaps that is all Nugget needs. You may have Nugget's Nugget. Nug Nugget's Nugget. It signifies our friendship. Uh, thanks? Do not consume the Nugget of friendship, for with its digestion, so too is our friendship digested. I won't. Good, Nugget will see you later, friend. No more talking now. Shoo! Okay then. So I have a Nugget. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Wanna be my boyfriend? I'm so through with bugs. What happened with bugs? 
we broke up. He was so jealous, he'll probably be mad at me if he sees me with anyone else. It'd be smart to get rid of him before we started dating. I'm not interested. Hey, Monty, if you need something, come talk to me. Odds are I can get it for you for the right price. What I need and what I sell changes throughout the day, so come see me often. Um, I want to buy something. Here's what's for sale. Um, hmm. I'm not going to buy anything just yet. I'm Jerome. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. What is cool? All the stuff Monty sells is pretty cool, except for voice recorders, because snitching isn't cool. Noted. Not that it matters to you. I always spend my time out here alone. I might put up with you during morning time if you got something cool to show me. Noted. How you doing there, Sonny? Don't mind the old janitor here. Just sweeping up after you silly cretins. Sweepy sweeps. Sweepy sweepy sweepy. Um. That's a mop. Ah, so it is. You're also mopping the sidewalk. I'll be mopping your blood off of it if you don't skedaddle. Okay. Hi, Mrs. Applegate. I have been well endowed ahem, with excellent teaching qualities. Sure have. Do have anything else to say? No more talking now. Shoo. Okay. Um, I think I'm just gonna skip to the, like, morning time section. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. And that's describing me. As long as you're the best you, you can be. Nugget does not wish to spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. You were curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting. Perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Perhaps. Nugget is in need of a magnifying glass. Oh, I see. So now that I... Let's go, let's go do Nugget's thing. Oh, I understand. Maybe. Oh, wait, no. How do I... Mm, how do I get into the cubby? I already got busted with that stolen pass before. The hall, man hall monitor will catch me no matter what. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, I'll look at all of it later. Oh, wait. Wait, isn't this the janitor's closet? How do I get over there? It's a bucket that's catching the blood from that thing on the table. This will be a truly vile thing to dump on someone's head. I'll take the note, but I can't read it because I'm in kindergarten. Oh, bummer. Hey man, you heard the bell. Go on back to your class. Well, did you get it? What? Okay. Hmm. I couldn't get the magnifying glass and I couldn't get the laser point. Hmm. How do I get the magnifying glass? Well, darn. I don't exactly know how I get it. 
Oh snap, you got that from Drum, didn't you? I gave you five dollars for it. That's a deal. I don't need anything else. Um. Hmm. Okay, does Nugget have anything different to say? Huh. Okay. I am confusion. Oh, you have a Monstermon card to sell. Oh yeah, this is the Holy Knight card. He's pretty powerful in the world of Monstermon. Fifteen dollars? I can't afford that. I think I messed up the day. Trust me, you love it. No one has ever not loved the Nugget Cave. Not going. Oh, you'll go. One way or another. You'll go. I'm so confused on what I'm supposed to do. It's a little note. Let's see what it says. Oh, it appears to be a recipe of some sort. Oh dear God, the janitor is eating Cindy's dog. What? That old man is dead meat. Cindy, stop. Oh, who am I kidding? Let's just move on to the next kid for show and tell. Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. Right. Oh, Cindy's not out here. Sneaky snake. I don't exactly know how to progress. I'm going to have to look. What is this one? This is the sneaky snake card. It is so sneaky, we're not even sure this is a picture of it. Okay, let's look at the hints. Um, you don't need any special items to complete Jerome, Cindy, or the teacher's missions. Um, okay. I believe, if I remember correctly, um, if I go to school with the money, yeah, Bug says something. Hmm, I smell money. Yeah, someone is definitely carrying a bunch of money around here. Hey kid, you carrying any 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 cash? Yes. Excellent. Give me half or I'll split your empty skull with my foot. Okay. Good boy. Now go don't now don't go telling teacher about this, or you might turn out missing like that Billy kid. Oh I understand. Tell the teacher that bug threatened you. I need the voice recorder to give um to record it, I believe. And that'll get bugs in trouble. Get numb for me. Um, yo yo. Okay, yeah, let's. Wait. I have a yo-yo for you. Oh wait, was I supposed to talk to him beforehand? Let's restart the room. Oh, I'm dumb. 
like for some reason I was like, oh, why is he not like becoming my friend? It's like, okay. Um, okay, let's progress then. Like I'll do that later. Okay, let's do Jerome's quest line. I like how that's another Mossmon card. So what am I exactly doing? I thought it was in the janitor's closet. Yeah, get into the janitor's closet. Get the thing out of the stolen stuff box. Let's talk with the janitor. <laughs> What's going on there, boy? What's in those bags? What bags? I don't see no bags. Those bags. Oh, these bags. <laughs> Nothing for you to worry your stupid little head about. Now run along. Now I'm not gonna, not gonna get upset at him. The door won't budge. Someone must be in there. Gross. I can hear someone grunting on the other side of the door. It must be in use. The toilet is disgusting. The toilet is disgusting. Can't speak. This toilet is disgusting. There's no way I can use it. I should ask someone to clean it. It's bleeding. Um. Oh yes, the uh, bleeding. Say, did you know I'm required by law to stay at least one mob's length away from children at all times? How did that pa judgment get passed down? It's a long story, but it ends with someone on the end of a mop. That's all I needed to hear. Okay, how exactly do I get up to the stolen stuff box? I would assume I need to use the box. Or like something. How do I get it up there? Do I need, do I need to get like another mop or something? Like, maybe, like, I, like, knocked down the box or something? Hmm, I'm confusion. It is, but that's a tale for another time. Morbidly curious. Hehe. <laughs> Me too. That's what got me into that mess in the first place. Anyway, I don't think it would be appropriate for me to tell someone of your age that story. But it's okay for me to see a bloody bag in a bin? Right oh, You sure are a chipper, young sport. Here, take this nickel and buy yourself a bar of chocolate. Um, a nickel won't cut it. What do you mean a nickel won't cut it? A nickel is gonna have to cut it, or I'm gonna have to cut you. But chocolate is more expensive than a nickel. Oh, in that case, I'll let the old lunch lady to know it give you... No, and to give you chocolate at a price you would have seen back in my day before the whole mop incident. How about that? Good, now skedaddle. Hey, don't you go messing around with those bags. Okay, sorry. I'm confused on how I actually get the thing. Okay. I need to get the screwdriver to get that Monstermon card. I don't know how to get the... Oh. I need the screwdriver. Okay. Um, let's restart the day then. I need the screwdriver to get up there. Um... I'm not gonna bring any extra money because that's a waste of a uh, thing. Okay. Um, so I need. Okay, so buy the screwdriver. 
and buy the yo-yo. Okay. Let's skip to the thing. There we go. I don't know why I didn't, like, see that beforehand. Okay, get me out of here. There we go. Well, did you get it? Okay, so skip to lunch. Hey kid, over here. Well, did you get it? I got it. Dude, that's awesome. I just hope the janitor doesn't notice. He can be pretty, he can be pretty territor. Which one of you dead little children went into my closet? Oh geez, sounds like he noticed. You better hurry up and hide that thing before he gets here. If he catches you with it, you're a dead man. Where do I hide it? Um, the garbage can. Quick, throw it in there. Well, anyone want to step forward? No? Well, what a surprise. What about you, little junior principal? I took your lasery thing this morning. I'm sure you want it back. Search me, man. I don't have it. So screw off or I'll tell my dad you peed in the water fountain again. You win this round, kid. What about you? You been in my closet? Turn out your pockets. Hmm, nothing. I still got my eye on you. Oh, just leave the poor things alone. You're always looking for a reason to impale a child on that mop of yours. So what if I am? Ain't nothing wrong with impaling a child. Just go sell your mystery meat. Fine, but mark my words. Someone will pay for going into my closet. Actually, before you get started, that garbage can needs emptying. Go take care of it. Grumble, grumble. Stupid lunch lady making me do a stupid job. Well, that was fast. There's no way you took it all the way to the dumpster. Would you relax, woman? I dropped it off in the bathroom. I'll get it after the bell rings. Sheesh, old broad is just, the ma just, is just mad the kids like my food better than, her better than hers. Well, that didn't go quite as planned. At least you're not dead. That's a relief. What now? I hate to ask this of you, but you need to go get it. The janitor said that it's in the bathroom. What's in it for me? I know I'm asking a lot for you, but just work with me on this. I'll make it worth your while. Fine. I'll go pay off the lunch ladies so you can get out. Just hurry back. The janitor will be taking that garbage out shortly after the bell rings. We'll pay it off then. Okay, she said she'd let you out. Go get it. Fine. Up there goes Lily. Okay, it's in the bathroom, right? Huh? You... You're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is... Unless... Unless what? Um, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'd be willing to sell you off. Well, I've been willing to let you off. But I have a hall pass. Nice try, little man, but that pass isn't good for lunch. I don't have any cigarettes. Major bummer, man. Looks like we're gonna go visit the principal. Oh. You can't just be running around the school during lunch. You should know better. I'm sorry. Me too. Me too. Why are you sorry? Oh. I do have cigarettes. Hell yeah! Thanks so much, little guy. Go do what you gotta do. Be around, little man. Ah, there we go. 
Oh, did the slob give you the run? Sorry about that. Hope it worked itself out. All the other kids are out at recess now. Go run along. Hey, kid. Come over here. Rome breathed me on your little mission. Did you manage to get the laser from the bathroom? Yep. Good. I don't know if you noticed, but the janitor is watching Jerome a little too closely. It looks like he's about to kill him. We gotta do something about it. What do you mean? That old man has been harassing kids for decades. I think it's time we finally got even with him. How do we do that? I'm gonna take the laser as collateral for my services here today. He'll get it back when he pays me. Okay, now what? Jerome gave me this. It's one of his dad's little bugs. Little things tend to pop up to pop if they don't like what they hear. Don't worry, I deactivated it. What do I do with it? You just worry about putting it behind the janitor without him seeing you. I'll handle the rest. Come see me when it's done. I see. Can I place the device? Yes, please. Did you place it? Yup. Excellent, this is gonna be good. Now, Jerome! Get back here, I ain't done questioning you, questioning you yet. Oh, jeez. Bit brutal. Jeez, dude, I told you to distract him, not blow him up. Eh, he had it coming. I'm not gonna bother with the voices anymore. It's starting to hurt my throat. The janitor just exploded. Yes, he did. The irony here is that there's no one to clean up the parts. Can we just go inside? Yes, I think that would be for the best. Right. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? A Monstermon card? Oh, come on. You have to be more creative than that. We're gonna skip you. Who's next? Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Well, kid, I'm impressed. You put up with this whole crazy day just because I told you it'd be worth it. It is, trust me. That's, it's just a shame that it required Monty taking the laser pointer until I pay him back. Either way, you've earned this. What is it? It's a mold for a key to my dad's office. You get this made, you can, and you can go in there anytime. Uh, you couldn't just give me a key? My dad is pretty secretive about his office. I'm pretty sure he has the only key to it, so it'd be grateful you even have the chance to make a key for it. How can I even get this made? Monty can hook you up. Just bring it to him at the beginning of the day and he'll figure it out for you. Okay then. This is where we part ways, man. You're pretty cool. I'll see you around. Okay, bye. Key mold. I was gonna say, I also got a Monster Mon card. Tornado fly. Okay. Monday, again, times three. This is the tornado fly card. This fly can generate tornadoes by flapping its wings. But it's wrong. They're not very big because he, he's a bug. 